Okay, so clearly I um, cut myself. I'm bleeding. It doesn't hurt though. <laughs> y'all welcome back how you doing i'm glad to see you here and thank you for being with me today i just got my hair braided yesterday as you can see i went to my girl mai out here in la and she kills it every time i am so happy i got knotless braids i just needed to change that little mini afro it's not mini it's getting big but it was becoming a toxic relationship and I needed to send it on vacation. So, yes, I got my braids going. I'm feeling so cute and like a baddie. So I'm really happy with that. I am about to dermaplane my face for the first time. And I've also been thinking a lot about the concept of consistency. So we're gonna chat and I'm gonna German plane and we're gonna see how this turns out. I have a mini Sephora haul, so I'm about to get to it. Hold on a second. Someone is knocking on the door. Hold on. Oh my gosh. I just got flowers delivered. That is really freaking sweet. Uh, wow as we all know it's mother's day tomorrow and somebody thought about me thank you that was really sweet that was really sweet and that like touched me to be thought of <sighs> well consistency guys I, okay, first let me show you my little mini Sephora haul. It's maybe not mini because I got some cute stuff. Hold up. So like legit 100%, I am trying to do better with my skincare routine. I'm really trying to like up it because I want my skin to glow. And I don't have many problems with my skin right now other than it's dry. So that's all. But so for starts, like I said, we're going to start with some dermaplaning. So I went ahead and got this Dr. Um, Jart Cryo Rubber Mask because I hear that this is really good for moisturizing after and because I want my skin to be bright. <laughs> I got the brightening vitamin C one and the hyaluronic acid ones. So we got some masks. I got, oh, this, I opened it as soon as I got it. This little um, touch hand. It's so, it smells really good and it's just like good for sanitizing your hands and it's moisturizing and I think the packaging is cute. That's how they got me with that one. Aaliyah's face. That's my girl. I really, I respect her. I really do. And I was watching her video and she was talking about these Sephora squares. So I went and got them at Sephora because they're big. She said they were big and I was like, oh, I think I might like that. So here we are with that. Um, if you saw my last video, you saw how much I freaking love this fragrance. Missing Person by Fleur. <sighs> I have an obsession, guys. I'm obsessed. I got the travel size because I just, uh, you know, I was like, I could just pop this in my purse right quick when I just want to smell it. So I really, um, I was going to spray it for real. <laughs> It ain't want to let me know, but oh, we're not giving up. We don't give up on this channel. That's one thing I don't be doing is giving up. Ah! So, uh, yes, I got the travel size of missing person. We're just going to, you know, put it back in the packaging that I bought. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, these little lashes. Because the video I'm uploading tomorrow I have my shirt that I just made and I love it and I was like I'm gonna wear these little lashes and photograph it and like create content using my cute little top so I got these lashes for my new shirt that I just made that you guys will see tomorrow on the channel and rose hip seed oil because I'm about to dermaplane and I wanted something or I just hear this is good so I got the ordinary rose hip seed oil I've actually been trying to get this but Sephora ain't never have it so, um, 
I got it. And they had to go to the back to get it. And then I got the face razor. I almost got this uh, expensive $200 like derma flash um, thing. But I thought to myself, why not just try this first before spending a million and seventeen dollars on a device that's going to get this effect. So and I read a lot of reviews on it too before I made this decision. But I think this is the route I want to go. So we're going to try that out. And then last but not least, my girl Riri, I got the uh, lava lemon lava heat plumping gloss bomb because Riri's killing the game right now and I just want to support her. So that's all I got from Sephora. Let's get to derma planing. There is one thing about me. I freaking love all things beauty, fashion, and self-help related. And while I was at the mall today, I also got this rose, vanilla rose syrup. Another thing about me is you cannot tell me I'm not a barista. I <laughs> love, love, love making like different drink concoctions. I used to serve at my church coffee shop. Like I love making new little cute coffee drinks so anywho i got this new syrup today so i think i'm going to try to make a matcha oat milk latte using this vanilla rose syrup and we'll see how it goes for starts we're going to cleanse the face using my fenty skin cleanser <sighs> consistency consistency guys it's all about consistency i think i said this in one of my videos everything you want in life is on the other side of consistency and that is so freaking true like if you think about it if you want your waist to get smaller you have to eat fresh healthy foods consistently in order to attain that goal it can't just be like one time two times, three times. It has to be consistently, daily. You have to incorporate it into your lifestyle, your daily routine with exercising, with like getting better at a certain thing. Like with dancing, you have to practice consistently, watch videos with, if you are a hair beauty like guru and you, you have to learn like knotless braids weren't a thing back in the 90s, but now they are. So like consistently working on your craft and, and practicing you know, those things are so important. So that is a huge thing I'm learning. And even today I'm feeling a little bit creative. Like I just said, I want to try to make a drink, but I think I'm going to take this basic white hoodie that I have and create something using some fabric that I, um, that I have. So consistency is key, my friends. Consistency is what are some things that you want to become more consistent at? What are some things that you just want to, you know, be better at and, and sharpen your skill in? I'm going to go ahead and go in with that rosehip seed oil, which is here, and start dermaplaning. Hopefully I don't cut my face up. Or like, my biggest fear is that any little peach fuzz is going to turn black and grow back like mad thick. That's what I don't want, y'all. That is what we don't have time for, is Gorilla Face. I want the benefits of it. So we finna try it. Here we go. I believe I need to go in an upward motion. Oh, shoot. Oh my gosh. There's so much little peach fuzz. <gasps> and y'all saw, I only did like two little scrapes. Wow. Okay. Oh, we doing this now. There's a whole little fluff. Do you see the fluff hanging? Okay, so clearly I um, cut myself. <laughs> As you can see, I'm bleeding. I was just about to, it doesn't hurt though. <laughs> so this thing's sharp. This little Sephora metal razor is what I got. And uh, it's sharp, so. But it doesn't hurt. Hopefully it doesn't scab or scar. If it does, it'll probably just look like a freckle. But uh, yeah, so something I've been self-conscious of is um, 
well. That's very vulnerable. My chin. <laughs> my chin, y'all. I be getting dark hairs on my chin. And one time I was out with this guy that I liked and he did that cute little thing to your chin. And he kind of like stayed in that area with his thumb a little bit too long. And in my mind I was like, does he feel the chin hairs there? Or like, what's he thinking? He didn't say anything and I <laughs> didn't either. But I'm sure that the cute moment was totally overshadowed by my loud inner thoughts because so anyway, that's just a look into the inside of my brain. But I was like, no, that's a no, because see, I'm a baddie. <laughs> I'm a baddie. We can't have that. So anywho, I like this for that because I, I usually wax, but sometimes even like waxing, I feel like I have to wax like every freaking day and it doesn't get it because the hairs are so short. It um, helps moisturizers penetrate your skin a lot more deeper because you're removing not only like the little hairs from your skin but you're also um that's just like a bonus but you're also getting that little bit of dead skin off of the top layer of your skin with doing this so that's why i got the mask that we're gonna do right after i finish with this okay so i just finished and i'm like why haven't i done this sooner okay so next is my mask this is like a very uh intense mask let's see what are the instructions an intensive moisturizing kit with a cooling and moisture lock-in rubber mask that boosts the absorption okay step one open stick apply evenly on skin two open rubber mask pouch remove protective film apply upper and then lower and then let it sit for 30 to 40 minutes in case you're interested this is what it look like let's do it it look like this okay oh okay it's bouncy i really hope this doesn't this isn't a bad idea being that i just did that to my face i'm worried because i can't lie my skin feels like extra sensitive right now it feels very sensitive I have sensitive skin and I'm I can feel the penetration of this <laughs> penetrating my pores and whatnot all right finishing out this little vial put it on the forehead next we open up this Euphoria. Okay. So, here's the upper mask. All right. Wow, this is like, oh, it's like kind of jelly. It broke. So, we're not going to try to move it too much. We're going to just glide it over the face and the lower mask. Wow. I look crazy but anywho this is my matcha drink whoo y'all I just choked on my first sip but I had to <laughs> hit record it was bad it was bad but I had to hit record because oh my gosh it's so good I don't know if you're a floral fan or not I personally am I love lavenders I love roses don't mind the fact that I have this blue mask on my face <clears throat> but this rose syrup it's so good mixed with matcha huge fan like it is a really nice flavor really nice flavor i feel bougie like really expensive drinking this right now so that's the reason why i had to bring it home today but um i know i mentioned i'm gonna make a plain hoodie into something more exciting so i'm probably gonna do that after i edit so who knows i might batch shoot today uh, but for now, we're just going to get to editing, so I'm going to stop this video here, and let's see if I, what this hoodie becomes later. 
Love you guys. Bye. <laughs> this mask. <laughs> I had a dream last night, last night. Did everything I never do in